Someone traveled through here recently. They're gonna be zipping back right here. Oh, they got absolutely shit on. Calling upon Oh, there's a whole bunch of them. There's a nice port for you. I think, is that? Nope, more. Oh, scan for you. I'm a little far out. Oh, see the one pushing to our left? What's up, YouTube? My name is T-Bone, and I am starting a challenge to get a win with every Apex Legend. I'm a very mediocre player. I'm currently a gold player and ranked, and I want to show you guys what I learned through this process. So I'm going to get right back to it and show you guys the end game of this win and kind of talk about what I learned. So like and subscribe. Thanks. Okay, so oh, here's oh, the situation. Shit. We are, this is the final team, um, and we have high ground currently, but we're outside of the circle. So we found out where they are, and we're just taking some pot shots at them. Nothing really big is going on, except I use this opportunity to scan. Um, that was the big thing about Bloodhound. I think it kind of goes without saying, but you want to use the scan as much as you possibly can. Uh, here, I pretty much figured out that anytime we were going to be in a close range fight, not a long range fight, but in a close range fight, I would go ahead and pop my ult. Um, the extra movement is awesome, and then all the information that you gain. So your job as Bloodhound should be basically to give your team as much information as possible, and for you to use that information to make oh, the plays. So, I know this Valk is here. Valk is not a Valk's threat right now. Sir, I'm staying. Right I want to keep an eye out for my team. I want to. I'm getting the scan back, waiting for the scan. Now that I have the scan, I want to hit it again. Make sure that I'm keeping an eye on that, and again, giving my team as much information as possible. Hey, see if you can get defenses on this staircase. Move over here to cover our back because of what uh, I didn't see the full team on the scan, but I knew they were there. Did some damage on this uh, other Bloodhound here. Now, my team's got this held down, so I'm going to go ahead and cross over to the other side so that I know what's going on on that side, and I make sure no one surprises us, because they currently know where the enemy is. Hit the scan to give my team information again. Okay, so I drop down, but I don't have a good angle here, but I can see things, again, that my team cannot. So I decide to try and make a play. But I can't see anything, and that's just a knock, so I'm not terribly concerned. We see they have a purple shield, not a gold. I'm at the disadvantage now because Costa can see me. I cannot see him. So, going around trying to make another play. My teammate calls out Bloodhound's crack. It's time to push. Did a little bit of work. Did a little bit of work. Moving forward, scanning again. See what he's up to. And then burn him with the flatline. All right. We got one down. Two down, so there's one person left up. I go ahead and pop a bat. Someone might have gold, watch out. Get the full kill, why not? Alright, he's full killed. And then I hear the res go off right here. Give us a scan. Not yet. Yep, scan Someone's again. Killed. They're resing, they're resing. Let my team know, and then we just triangulate. And that's the end of that. I shoot at the wrong person, but that doesn't really matter. Hey, there we go, baby! And that's a win. That's what I'm talking about. It only took an hour and 38 minutes. Jesus Christ. Even Me and Wraith have the exact same amount of sniping. damage. That's hilarious. All right, so yeah, thanks for watching. It was a short video. Um, we will be doing these live on stream if you want to see us try and get this challenge. Um, I think I'm going to combine them into two legends per video just because this was so short there wasn't a lot of content. Um, but yeah, I'm T-Bone. I play Apex, and I try and have fun with it. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed, and I will see you guys later. Peace out.